Hi folks, it's Danny from Bradley James Classics and this is the time of year we list some of our trade-ins and cars that we've had tucked away uh, for sale as projects. Um, now this particular car, despite the fact that it clearly needs a new wing, in fact I think it needs wings both sides. In fact if you really wanted to uh, get carried away and restore it you might even want to paint the whole car or you might just want to fix it up for an inexpensive modern classic now it is of course a mercedes w124 uh, coupe um, from 1989 it's a 300 ce now the 300 means it's got the uh, three liter six cylinder petrol engine which is the desirable engine in these they did a four cylinder as well uh, now considering the w123 uh, coupe is pretty much an unaffordable car these days um, and they do get fixed up and fetch a lot of money i dare say the 124 is going to be the next one in affordability lines to consider doing up because they just happen to be a pretty fantastic car now um this one obviously is going to be priced appropriately because it is a project car but it would be a crying shame to not have this car return to the road now the front wings were always well known for corrosion and just look how bad that one is very typical in fact that's a bit that's been broken off completely um but actually it's only the front wings that need replacing and believe it or not even good old euro car parts can supply you these wings for tens of pounds and not hundreds um it's a car that you can still buy panels for it's a car that can be repaired now it's an attractive color scheme when fully cleaned all it's had is a quick pressure wash to get all the dust off of it but it's a light metallic blue and it's got slightly darker panels through the bottom that sort of contrasting two-tone that mercedes used to do now it's a good spec because mercedes used to rather enjoy charging lots of money for extras so the car itself has got uh, a sunroof uh, electric it has got full leather interior and if you look at the quality of the seat and just how good a condition that's in they're very acceptable and certainly the back um i'll have a sit in Ugh. And like anyone who knows their Mercedes, they were quite keen on charging for all these extras. So it's quite a uh, a nice burr, I don't know if I'd call that a burr walnut interior, but that's nice. The door cards have got um, a nice leather insert as well with the, with, with the wood. Um, it has electric windows, it has heated seats, it has a period blow on stereo that probably is as old as the car. It's got electric windows and electric mirrors. And I don't know what went in there, but there's there's a there's a switch that used to be there that's not there anymore. Um, automatic, of course, I say of course, but sometimes you, you, you had the odd rare one that was a manual. And you've also got the economy and sports shift. It's a four-speed auto gearbox. Um, you've also got, whoa, look at this, adjustable electric seats. Again, quite an expensive uh, option that appears to only be on the driver's side but uh, it's uh, rather nice to have it there 184,000 miles um, which is again nothing to be too concerned about with a particular engine uh, a nice leather steering wheel um, and quite nice actually all the interior uh, condition so despite the fact that it does need a pair of wings on the front and the bodywork is less than ideal it certainly needs some attention um it is actually rather a um a nice example sat in, on the inside you definitely think wow this is a quite a classy car to be in so anyway let's have another quick look on the outside and for what i'm selling for what this is being sold for it's an absolute bargain that must be done up there's the uh, packet of um, documents it does come with a logbook and there is um, all of the manuals in there which is a nice thing to have because you don't always get that um, it comes with a couple of keys as well so just to reiterate it is a mercedes w124 um, 300 ce which is the coupe of course 
Uh, these cars did have quite a large boot, that one's locked. Um, it needs some bodywork repairs here, there's some corrosion and holding here. Um, back arches look okay, this door looks okay, got a bit of a scab there. Um, front wing terrible, the bonnet looks like it would go again. Some kind soul actually stole the Mercedes three-pointed star. Um, if you want to open the bonnet, you have to give that a pull, but I don't know if it's been actually done, undone from the inside. It's a three-litre straight-six petrol engine. Um, the tyres, well, you certainly wouldn't want to be uh, taking any chances with old perished tyres, and it looks like it's lost a bit of paint here. However, the rest of the car is quite presentable and it certainly is a project something that you could return to the road hopefully for a sensible price point well okay we've had six minutes looking around this mercedes project car if this is of interest please let us know we can have this car um, delivered anywhere in the uk for a sensible price and we'll be happy to help out with that transport we just need your um postcode to give you a quote anyway folks it's danny with a Project W124 Mercedes from 1989, signing out.